first of all, uh, credit Missouri. They came in and, and shot the ball very, very well. But I'll tell you, my team, I, we balanced and we, we, we attacked and we played together. And for 35 minutes, we were toe-to-toe -to -toe with Missouri, a really good team with, with, uh, with nice players. And when we uh, were able to take their best player in Oil Albert and play 10 minutes, uh, Kulis is a great player. And we got her in some foul trouble. And we had an opportunity after the technical foul to come out and maybe make that a five-point play. Didn't capitalize, but for 35 minutes, we played very, very good basketball and so much to build on. The message I said to the team, Nikki, was that um, it's, it's not okay to settle for getting close enough, and we're trying to change that mentality. Our players are, are I think, excited that we've improved over the week, and you're going to see that with this team. We're young, and you're going to see the baptism by fire. We started three freshmen today. One of whom was Aaron Nelson, had a great game. I thought Misi Price did a nice job at the point guard, really, really commanded the floor, played great defense, um, took some, some gutsy plays, uh, some charges, and, and some plays to the floor. Really pleased with her. I thought Olivia uh, Jacobisic did a nice job defensively. It doesn't show up on the scoreboard, but her hustle points and her rebounding um, are certainly well noted. But um, again, it was a, a great game, nice crowd, uh, nice homecoming for uh, some of the St. Joe players that are from this area. Uh, Doty obviously is from this area as well and knew that there was a lot of hype going into the game. Uh, first game for both teams. I'm very pleased with our team's performance for 35 minutes. But close, close, just being close is not good enough and that was the message. But also to stay positive knowing that we took care of the basketball. We wanted to have less than 15 turnovers. We wanted to get to the free throw line 20, 20 plus times. We did, but did not capitalize, an area that could be fixed. We wanted to keep them in the 50s. We didn't do that, but for the most part, played very good defense. And then we wanted our rebound Missouri, and we did have the rebounding edge until late in the game where they got back-to-back -back boards, so we lost the rebounding battle by two. But overall, again, a very great night for our team, a lot to build on. We played a great team. We wish Missouri the very best the rest of the year. Um, and this team is going to get better every single day. Aaron is, is a player that uh, has the green light. And I pulled her to the side and I said, if you have any room, I need you to shoot the ball. She works at her game, and it shows. She's a great shooter. She was our only player that had a high shooting percentage. We struggled. We shot under 30% for the team. And without Aaron, it would have been um, a little bit more dismal. So we credit Aaron a lot for her um, great first game as a, as a Billiken. And we're looking forward to more things out of Aaron. The, the secret will not be out, or the secret will now be out, I should say, on Erin in terms of her ability to shoot from the outside. But the girl can score. Her defense has improved immensely. I'm really proud of her. She works at it. She wants to be a great player. And this kid is, is special. She is special, and we're certainly glad she's here wearing a Billiken uniform. And, and uh, we look forward to her continuing to, to put pressure on defenses because of her ability to score.